At the Kingston Frontenac Public Library, the silence is interrupted by the occasional gasp or even a snicker. <laughs> I think it's brilliant. I think she's making a statement. This, shall we say, uncensored reaction, all because of this painting showing the Prime Minister in a rather, well, unconservative pose. <laughs> it's social satire and political satire. Kingston artist Maggie Sutherland says the piece is a modern take on previous Impressionist paintings and a reference to Hans Christian Andersen's The Emperor's New Clothes. Art should provoke discussion and uh, I even a little hate mail, <laughs> which I've been getting this morning. The painting was unveiled at the library earlier this month after being selected by the Kingston Arts Council. It is selling for $5,000. One of the challenges for the library, however, is that this painting, dare I say, hangs in a room which is used for meetings and children's recitals. The library has even received calls saying some Kingston residents plan to pick it outside to express their opposition. Some people who, who think we should take it down and it's not appropriate for a public library. Part of it is, again, balancing that, that intellectual freedom with community standards. We cover it up just when there were kind of children's recitals going on. The rest of the time it will be available. Sutherland says this strips the piece of some of its meaning, but at least it is still being shown. As for what the Prime Minister thinks about the art, there was a Twitter comment uh, from someone affiliated with the PMO's office this morning saying that uh, they were not impressed that everyone knows the Prime Minister is a cat person. It seems the PM is certainly comfortable in his own skin. Then again, if he has reservations, there are ways of covering up. <laughs> or a fig leaf or something. A fig leaf, maybe a maple leaf. Anthony Robart, Global News.